Would you like to see your story featured on the Cat's Eye News? If so, email us. Please send us pictures, videos, or any other information you want included. You guys are the ones with the best stories, so sharing them with us will make the news way more interesting. Today we're asking Nova Kids, what's your favorite Christmas movie? Um, I would say Santa Claus. Um, probably National Lampoon's Christmas. Daddy's home to the Christmas one. Home Alone. <laughs> the holiday. Elf. 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 Um, probably Elf. Home Alone. Thank you for your time. Hey seniors, if you're interested in Novi local scholarships, they will be opening on Friday, December 9th. We talked to Mrs. Tobis about how you can be a part of this. The Novi Local Scholarship Program is something we run every winter for our seniors, and it is scholarships provided by community organizations that are only available to our Novi seniors, so you have a much better chance of winning versus a national scholarship. So next week, our seniors will receive an email from me that has a join code for our local scholarship Schoology course. Within that course, you will have access to the descriptions of the about 30 scholarships this year. You'll have access to an application that is used for every single scholarship. So you fill it out once and you can submit it to all the scholarships. Some of them do have essays or letter of recommendation requirements which are outlined in there. And you'll submit your applications in the Schoology course again this year. But there's also a checklist. So that's a paper form that you will turn into our office with our secretary, Mrs. Alex, in order to let us know which scholarships you applied for so that we can re release your transcript and attach it to your scholarship. So the applications will open on Friday, December 9th. You'll have all the way through winter break to work on them, as well as some days before and after, and then they are due on Friday, January 20th. The checklist though, we will still take that checklist Monday, January 23rd, but after that, that's the deadline. <laughs> about all of the resources in the Schoology course. The code is DZCNCNSDQNB2B. This, along with other information, will be included in the email that Ms. Tobis will send. If any other questions, you can email her here at andrea.tobis at novak12. You can also email Mrs. Chin, who oversees the program. Good luck, seniors. Hey Novi, the girls in white coats are doing a bottle drive from December 1st through the 9th. So if you have any extra bottles, be sure to bring them to Mrs. Show's room, room 110. See you later, Novi. Ho, 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 hey Novi High School. The Abbey Seniors are putting on a Christmas Wonder event where Novi students can perform a musical talent at local senior homes. The events take place all throughout the month of December, so scan the QR code to sign up for the date that works best for you. If you have any questions, feel free to contact Mr. Capilano or DM at Novi IV Cohort on Instagram. Thank Are you interested in playing men's volleyball? Miss Pulse is having a meeting in room 189 on December 14th at 3 p.m. Stop by for information about sign up and the season. Thanks, Wildcats. What's up, Wildcats? My name is Rodney Hackman, and I'll be covering your girls' basketball. Hey, Novi, make sure to check out your girls' basketball team tonight. They take on Birmingham Grove, so be there. Hey, Novi, I'm Sky Waking. With Mia Roberson this year, we're going to be covering the figure skating team. Their first competition is on the 10th, but until then, we're flipping out. Our Novi wrestling team is starting soon. They have a match next Wednesday the 7th, and they'll have a tournament following that two days after on Friday. Good luck to our Wildcats. Your eSports Corner guys, this week we entered the state tournament. Overwatch unfortunately lost their first game, ending their regular season with a 5-3 record. Good job guys. Both Smash teams, however, won their tournament games and will move on next week to the next round. CSGO won their playoff games as well and is now in the state semifinals. 
Valorant Green was unfortunately forced to forfeit, although Valorant White took that personally and won two underdog games, moving them to the quarterfinals. Rocket League has their first game today, and we'll update you next time on the Esports Corner. Hi, hey Nova, it's Leo. And I'm Scott. And we're going to be covering the boys and girls bowling team for the rest of this season. All right, Scott, when's the first tournament? So the first tournament is actually coming up this Saturday in the morning. We're actually getting there, and I think the tournament starts at 8.30 a.m., which is pretty crazy. All right. Scott, what's your goal for the team for this tournament? Obviously, just to defeat Northville. That's all we really care about. Hi, Wakey, and you're watching the Cat's Eye News. We'll see you next week.